guys, welcome to our newest video. This video is all about Gabby's new saddle. I should say Gabby and Storm's new saddle. Because whoever... it says Stormy Night on it. Like... And whoever rides Storm is going to get to ride in that saddle. So we are going to spill all the tea. You're doing that one. Gabby found a crazy red chestnut and she's like, I love that girl. We're going to do that comment. Okay, that question. Anyway, we decided we were going to spill. Spill the question. We are going to spill the tea on the new saddle because a lot of you guys have a lot of questions and we're just going to get right down to it and tell you guys what exactly mm -hmm. happened, what we got with the saddle and why we chose that saddle. Because so, the saddle's gorgeous. Mm -hmm. It's a really nice saddle. We have not tried it yet. I'm not going to lie. I have sat on it on mom's knees. I have sat on and, it on Sam's and knees. It, and it does not feel like any brand new saddle. It's so comfy. It feels I like have, the seat's been used, but it's not. Yeah, I she, have never sat on it. She uh, likes things that are like worn in and worked in and she doesn't like hard new things. So Crazy Red Chestnut, Gabby wanted to answer her question and she says it's actually not a question. I'm just interested to see how it impacts Storm's movement and muscle development and Gabby's seat riding. Um, obviously, you'll probably only see big differences a few weeks or months after using it, but I will be very interested to see the difference over time. And all I wanted to say about that is that um, she's amazing. You guys should check her out on Instagram, Crazy Red Chestnut. I stalk her Instagram. Yeah, but... You got a shout out. But... Um, when uh, the saddle fitter did come, she did actually uh, um, adjust the saddle and get it shimmed, uh, fit specifically to rebalance Gabby in the saddle because Gabby does lean really forward. So hopefully that'll make a big difference for him. Riding habits. Yeah. When I lean forward, the saddle leans back. So day by day blog dot edits underscore. She was really curious about what happened to it coming in January, but instead it came two months later. That seems strange. And there is a story. There is a crazy story. So uh, um, basically there was um, an issue with the saddle. When we placed the order, something went wrong. We didn't know it went wrong. It was over Christmas. We were expecting it to take uh, six to eight weeks, but maybe 10 weeks because it was Christmas time. Um, so we didn't even look into it, nothing. And then all of a sudden mm -hmm. after Christmas, when I did look into it, I was able to see that there was an error, there was a problem. Uh, so all production on our saddle was halted until that got figured out. I will say that even though it took a ridiculously long time because of the error, um, once we got it fixed up and settled out, it took less than a month to arrive from the time we got the, the problem fixed. It took us less than a month. So it, it, we did wait a long time, but it just was because there was a problem. Scott, okay. Stuart underscore and underscore Amber underscore lover. So Stuart un and Amber lover. She wants to know how much was it? There were a lot of people that want to know this question and I'm going to show you our bill right here. We had the saddle fitter come out and I told her my budget is $3,000, maybe $4,000 if you find a really nice saddle because when a saddle fitter comes out, they can find you used saddles as well. So she came out and I was like, <sighs> And I was like, this is her budget. And she said, okay. So we tried the saddles to see which one Gabby would like better. And in the end, she gave us such a good deal on a brand new saddle that we were like, okay, let's just go for the brand new saddle. Custom saddled. made. Custom made one. Perfect I would have paid. Storm. I only paid a small amount more than I would have paid for a used saddle of the same caliber. So it just was a really good deal for us. So we ended up taking the deal. That is the only reason we bought custom. But now that we did buy a custom saddle. We're um, never ever buying a new like, again. <laughs> well, yeah, we are because this mama is not made of money. But it was the best experience. Other than it was a long wait, um, it, it's been so far a really good experience. So Hopefully oh, it fits him. Yeah, like we're still at that point where we still don't know if it Can fits him. Can I make a comment? Uh, sure. So anyways, the cost of the saddle. How much did the saddle cost? The, I don't know. You won't tell me. The saddle alone, just the saddle, is um, the brand new jumping, close contact jumping saddle. It has a wide base on the bottom. Um, it, do you remember the name of it? Birat's okay. Lab is the name of the saddle. Okay. Is the name of the saddle. And the saddle, brand new, costs seven thousand and fifty five dollars isn't that crazy for a saddle oh, but, didn't get that. but it actually looks like it's a seven thousand dollar saddle um all the rest of the stuff added up to over a thousand dollars like the sweatshirts and the 
all the other stuff um, that was actually given to us free um, amazingly we got um, stir up leathers we got all the stuff that comes to clean the saddle I think you get that with the saddle anyway um, if you buy a, a new saddle um, we got sweatshirts we got uh, stirrup leathers and we got a saddle pad and we got a girth a really nice girth so all that came mm -hmm. free so what we actually ended up paying for the saddle I wish we got a bridle though too and one to match with taxes um, it was eight thousand dollars and we ended up paying complete all the way taxes everything uh, just under five thousand dollars like four thousand four hundred and ninety seven dollars or something no four thousand four hundred and ninety seven dollars or something like that I will attach a copy of the actual price uh, I'll attach something here to show you how much everything costs individually in case you guys are interested yeah there's no point for the comment Okay, which Sophia one did you pick? Okay, Sophia wants to, uh, Sophia picked a comment. It's page dot night dot one two three. Did you have to pay extra for the stirrup leathers and girth and sweater and other stuff? <laughs> <laughs> she picked that before I went on and on and on. She's like, oops. <laughs> so no, we actually got all that stuff for free, which is amazing. Uh, Rachel underscore Duick is Sophie. Oh, this is a good one. Oh. That one. Um, is Sophie upset that she doesn't get a custom saddle too? Sophie, come on, tell us, spill the tea. No, because I know someday I'll get a saddle. Yeah. You're squishing me. And yeah, exactly. When it's when the time comes, she will get her own saddle, and she'll love when it. When she gets a new horse. Um. Okay. So Rachel Newmark, Newmark, Rachel Newmark. Why did you choose foam saddle over wool, especially since Storm's confirmation will likely change again? Do you know? So we got foam and we got foam because we could use it on any horse and Storm loves foam saddles better than um, wool. Has Storm ever Flops. ridden in a foam, foam yes, saddle? Yes, um, a race car driver saddle that he brought for Storm to ride in is um foam and storm loves that saddle mm -hmm. and you could just bring it to the bar and put it on any horse yeah so basically mm -hmm. um the wool saddles often need to be reflocked over time because it kind of compresses and changes shape over time and um a foam saddle doesn't typically do that and usually you can uh saddle of this kind of quality you can usually use on multiple different horses so that works out really well for us Storm's confirmation does change. We can alter the saddle. The saddle can still be altered. So Samantha5947 says, I would like to know how much it costs exactly and the website you ordered it off of. I'm a Western rider and I barrel race. Um, so we actually found a saddle fitter at the Royal Winter Fair this past fall and she came and she ordered the saddle for us. It's probably easier if you order it through a saddle fitter so that they can come and make sure that it fits your horse. Mm -hmm. um, but it's Devaku. So if you go to Devaku.com, you can find out anything you need to know. Um, Priscilla, what is it yeah, this way. Priscilla Wren dot W says, "Does Gabby regret anything about the design?" So Gabby, so buying a custom saddle was super cool because, because I got to pick no stitching, like on the uh, leg flap thingy. She got to on the fully customize the entire thing. So mm -hmm. what did you actually end up choosing, Gabby? I chose the red piping, but before it was um, red stitching, which is not allowed in showing for showing. So we got red piping instead. Um, and we got white stitching, because, yeah. Um, and... Um, and she got to choose what name she put on the back plate. She got to choose. Mm -hmm. We got to choose what kind of leather we wanted. So, guys, wanted. I, 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 put, I put the Stormy Night. She got to choose the it font. It says Stormy Night on here. She, we got to choose the font. I don't think. No, I didn't. Yeah, we did. Oh. So, the saddle fitter actually came to our house and sat down with us and showed us all this stuff. We got to choose um, the color of the leather. We got to choose the kind of leather. The amount of things we got to customize were limitless. Do you regret any of your choices? No. Do you still like the red? Yeah. Yeah. I, I, I love it. I think it looks even better than the ones that she brought to the barn for us to try. Mm -hmm. Um, because the other one at the barn looked more like lighter and the yeah. one's darker. Yeah. yeah. So underscore Rio underscore and underscore friends. What is it made of, real leather or fake leather? 
I have no idea. It is real leather. It is made of a bunch of different kinds, and I can't remember if it's um, if it's calf? calf skin. I don't think it is, or buffalo skin, or like there's a whole I bunch of things. Calf skin, because buffalo yeah. skin was the black one. Yeah, I can't remember. There are a lot of things for us to choose from. Um, Aaron under Aaron dot Becker wants to know: Are you guys worried this will restrict Stella's movement when Gabby rides her, or will she use the saddle she is currently riding in? Love your videos. So, <laughs> and then so, a person says, I believe the saddle was especially fitted for Storm. storm. Um, so this saddle was especially fitted for Storm. This is Storm saddle. If we can use it on Stella sometimes, then we will. The thing you guys don't know about Stella is that her body has changed so much. Our that, instructor was here and she yeah. said that Stella has a normal neck. She looks like a normal horse now. So um, Stella is at the part in her journey where she is finally at the right shape or pretty much close to it. And now she's going to be working on building muscle and building a top line and all those things. Mm -hmm. It could be true that very soon Stella will be in the market for a new saddle for herself. So we have three saddles now currently. Um, and she builds up more muscle. Uh, so we're just going to work with what we have until we get to a point where she does need one. She needs to, we need to uh, get her shape to a point where it's not changing constantly. EQ dot LC says, what came with your saddle? So we got a lot of stuff with our saddle. Good. So we Probably got need to buy. the care kit that came with it. So for cleaning and conditioning and a glove, we got the, the glove saddle. is amazing. Yeah, we got the saddle. We got uh, uh, stirrup leathers. We got a saddle pad. We got a girth and all three of us got sweatshirts. Now I can match Stormy. Yeah. Which All is right, Storm, we're wearing everything from Devaku today. Okay, so Brendan.2151 says, Why did you choose Devaku over other brands like uh, Butt, Butt Tit and CWD? <laughs> well, okay, we didn't choose that one because we can't even pronounce it. And um, CWD. I do not know any of those. Uh, so Devaku is now the same company as CWD. They are the same company. If you oh. phone a Devaku now, it actually says CWD when they answer the phone. So uh, they are the same company now. Um, and Trust the reason, me, mom has phoned a lot of times. So the reason we chose Devaku, why did we chose it? choose it? Because um, we wanted it. Because no, because race car driver saddle is from Devaku. And Storm loves that saddle. Yeah, so, and I love it too. Yeah, so, so Gabby uh, tried race car driver saddle when he first started ch coaching us. So uh, Gabby uh, pretty much sat in that saddle. Storm mm -hmm. performed so good. He actually stretched out and started to really go forward. And Gabby fell in love with that saddle. So it really seemed to suit both of them. We were looking for a saddle fitter. At so we decided to just stick with what was going to work, what was working for him. Um, KJG underscore equestrian says, I bought my most recent saddle myself and I don't have a permanent job. Is there anything Gabby did to contribute to buying the saddle? Just wondering due to the fact that it's a really expensive saddle for her horse. Gabby, do you do anything to contribute to the care of your horse? All I don't the, know. All the money she makes <laughs> to, um... Yeah, so... I um, make money on YouTube so just like... Yeah, so Gabby has her own channel. She's not been posting on it a lot recently because we've been really busy. But yeah, I could do a, um, a riding in my new saddle vlog. Yes, I am going okay. to do a vlog today. Okay. Yes. yes, that's a great idea. So basically, Gabby and Sophie both have YouTube channels and they also are in our YouTube channels. It's a huge job, huge, being on YouTube all the time, right? It, she, We post more than one video a day often. And the girls are a big, huge part of that. They both make money on their own channels. They contribute to making money on this channel. And they absolutely 150% contribute to every single thing that they get financially. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I make money. So make Olivia money. underscore the underscore great 13 says, how does the saddle feel? It's like no other saddle I've ever felt before. It's like brand new. But the seat is so comfy, and, like what the heck? And it's so soft. It's like almost like suede, but it's leather. And it, it's just, it's the softest material. Like it feels mm -hmm. like touching a baby cow. That's why I keep thinking it is calf skin. I can't remember. It does remember. not feel like that. It does. There's no hair on it. But it's so smooth and so soft. Like it's, it's. What um, size so, is it? So Jenna dot Malcolm, did you customize it on the website or in person with the saddle fitter? And are you going to get a saddle fitter out to fit it? So, Absolutely, we did uh, fit it with the saddle fitter, and unfortunately, part of the problem that happened is that they fired the saddle fitters in this area, so 
Um, All of them, not just a couple. Yeah, so unfortunately we do not have a saddle fitter. They do have one coming, an experienced one they said that's been doing it for a really long time. And she, she, she or he is. And we will have access to that person. We will even have them come out whenever there's a problem with the saddle at all. They'll come and they'll help us if we need to get it adjusted in any Which way, shape, or form. Which is a good thing for a too. Um, Abby Lowe said, what size is it? Did you get a bit no. larger so she could grow into it? And yeah, we absolutely did. That um, on the top one. Yeah, Gracie Bowden says, can we get a custom one? Of course, anybody can yes, get a custom one. Yes, anybody who is willing to pay will get a custom. Anybody who pays for like a new saddle. The girl with the rose tattoo said, I love it. I always adore brown equipment. That's awesome. It almost mm -hmm. looks like a chocolate brown. Like it's so pretty yeah. and the camera does not do it justice. I know. Olivia underscore four. Did you get a discount on your saddle? We absolutely did get a yes. discount on our saddle. So that was the only reason that we decided to go custom. But like I said, I'm so glad we did. Hammer.03 wants to know, I want to know how you compare the padded girth to the old one you had and how you think it's beneficial for Storm. So wait, what old one? Um, his old old one. Okay, so or his old. So one? he has a leather one that we bought with him, and which is a size too small. It's size fifty two, and he does not love that. So we ended up getting a fuzzy one, which he does like, and he mm -hmm. is more comfortable. He loves in. that one. <laughs> so this one is padded, so it's not just a leather girth. It's like it's got padding and foam in there. More so padding than his old old. So one. yeah, for a leather girth, and it has. Um, what is it? Elastic on both sides. Yeah. So do you think you'll, you'll ride him in that girth a lot or will you, um, save it for shows or something like that? I'm not sure. Um, so this one, Kara dot Sleeman, she's wondering, um, if it was difficult choosing what you wanted on the saddle. Oh man, it was difficult. <laughs> it took us a couple of days. I kept on messaging back. Wait, wait, we changed your mind. And then the person was like, okay, okay. Yeah, she okay. was really good. So we did, we, we changed a lot of things. It was really hard choosing like the color of the leather, the type of the leather, because we didn't even know what we were doing, but I think it turned out really, really well. Oh yeah, we got to choose the color of the leather. That's why it's yeah. different than yeah. that we tried. Yeah, and she also said, Sophie, I'm so proud of you for facing your fears you look amazing on storm keep up the good work and gabby you're doing amazing also thank you so much that was from lead Karen. changes Karen. we can we can go to the right rein with lead changes we can't just do the left rein we can't like do the left rein yet we can only do the right rein did we okay. test try the saddle before we bought it uh, not that question. one but a yeah different one. no we actually did that's the exact saddle that she purchased but it was uh but custom made it was a her. different one though Oh, it's the same one, just a different color. Exactly the same. It's called... No, they had to build it, right? Yeah, they had to... Yeah, so... Yeah, so we tried a different one, okay. but the exact same one. Yeah. So we did not try yeah. that exact saddle. Yes. That's what I'm saying. Yes. Yes. We did not so, try that exact same saddle. Yeah, like. so we tried that model, and then they built mm -hmm. us a brand new one. That's what Gabby's mm -hmm. trying to say. There were, there were a bunch of different leathers that we can choose from, and whatever one I chose... It's like really nice. Like I wish I knew because it. I think it, it's calfskin because it, the it other feels one, like calfskin. It, the it, other one was hard. The yeah, buffalo, buffalo was hard. So the buffalo skin was less expensive. Whatever we, I don't know. Whatever it is, is the nicest leather I've ever felt in my life. Like, mm -hmm. uh, have you ever seen another saddle like it? No, like not a brand new I one. Never, and not that yeah, exact like, same saddle. All the times we went saddle searching, we never ever have seen a saddle that looks like this. Like none of them feel like this or look like this. So and we could have chose that piping that where Gabby chose red. I'll try and insert a picture right here. Um, there's could, like a bunch of different you could colors choose of any red. color. You could choose green. You could choose yellow. You could choose white. You could choose any single color. So underscore rotting dot four dot ever underscore wants to know do you think that the brand has the quality you were looking for no i think that the brand supersedes the quality that i even ever dreamed of so that was the biggest shock to us when we got the saddle like mm -hmm. it, it it was the biggest shock the quality of the saddle and of the leather was oh, shocking yeah. and the quality of the the sweatshirts that we got it's not like just a regular sweatshirt that you find in the store yeah. the sweatshirts mm -hmm. cost $150 and they feel like they cost $150 like they feel like thick. they cost a thousand they're thick and heavy but they're not that old but they're material light they're like too. a light yeah like they're they the quality it's amazing. It's amazing. And I'm not just saying that because we bought that saddle. I would tell you if I thought that it would look cheap or it, it's so nice. Like hopefully it fits. No. 
And I messaged the CEO of the company and I said, I, uh, we got our saddle and I really hope that it fits our horse because I want to keep this saddle. Like it's the nicest saddle I ever have tried in my whole life. You definitely get what you pay for. Like I'm, I, I can't even express how much I was in shock over the quality of the saddle. Like I'll try and show you a little bit of it. Um, but yeah, the quality, and I don't know if it was because of the choices that we chose. One thing that our saddle fitter did tell us, even though she was fired from the company is that mm -hmm. No matter what happens, the saddle is amazing. Like, even when she got fired, she's like, the saddles are incredible. And she rides horses, so she knows. But anyway, that is it for this video. Do you have right. anything that you want to say, Sophie, about the saddle? I love saddles. I love saddles, too. Do you love that saddle? I love brand new saddles. Yeah. And do you have anything you want to say about the saddle? I love brand new saddles, and it's gorgeous. It's gorgeous. And, and I love the red color. Better, too. like, it's better than any other saddle I've ever seen. Do you, um, if you got to choose what other color you would put on your saddle, what color would you pink. choose? Pink. You would choose pink? I love the red, even though I, I like pink too. I love pink. Um, red so, and pink clash with everything. So I just wanted to say this about the saddle. It doesn't Shh. matter, it doesn't matter what kind of saddle you have. It doesn't matter what kind of saddle you buy. It doesn't matter what brand your saddle is. It doesn't matter what level of riding you're at when you get a saddle. All that matters is that you have, yeah, is that you have what you need to ride. Like buying an expensive saddle like this was a once in a lifetime opportunity for us. Um, we got a really good deal or we would never have bought it. Love what you have and be proud of what you have. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. We'll see you in the next one. Bye. Bye. <laughs> My true nature. Bye. <laughs>